Pedro Almodovar's call security to be on alert and stop Meghan Markle from getting on the red carpet as the room next door earns Mega 18-minute ovation at Venice Film Festival. The Venice Film Festival is no stranger to drama, glamour, and the occasional celebrity clash. But this year, it took an unexpected turn. Pedro Almodovar, the renowned Spanish filmmaker known for his vibrant storytelling and complex characters, found himself in the midst of a media frenzy when he reportedly called security to ensure that Meghan Markle wouldn't make her way onto the red carpet during the premiere of his latest film, The Room Next Door. With Almodovar's film receiving a staggering 18-minute ovation, the incident stirred up a whirlwind of headlines and speculation. Buckle up as we dive into the details of this captivating story, exploring the film, the festival, and the intriguing dynamics between celebrity culture and artistic expression. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. The Venice Film Festival, established in 1932, is one of the oldest and most prestigious film festivals in the world. Each year, it attracts a mix of A-list celebrities, emerging talents, and filmmakers from around the globe. The festival is famed for its picturesque setting, with the stunning canals of Venice providing a backdrop as glamorous as the stars themselves. This year, as the festival rolled into town, the excitement was palpable. Fans and media gathered in droves, hoping to catch a glimpse of their favorite stars. And as always, the red carpet became the ultimate stage for fashion, fame, and the occasional controversy. But among the glitz and glamour, one name stood out, Pedro Almodovar. The room next door marks Almodovar's return to the Venice Film Festival, and expectations were high. Known for his bold visual style, intricate narratives, and the exploration of complex themes such as desire, identity, and family, Almodovar has a reputation for captivating audiences. Starring a stellar cast, including seasoned actors and fresh faces, the film delves into the lives of two neighbors whose paths intertwine in unexpected ways. The narrative is rich with emotional depth, showcasing Almodovar's signature flair for storytelling. Critics hailed the film as a triumph, and it quickly became a festival favorite. When the film premiered, the audience erupted into applause, and the 18-minute ovation that followed was a testament to Almodovar's genius. The scene was electric, with viewers standing and cheering, celebrating not just the film, but the artistry behind it. Yet amidst the celebration, another story was brewing. As the lights dimmed and the room next door began, whispers of Meghan Markle's potential appearance at the festival ignited curiosity. The Duchess of Sussex has been a figure of fascination and controversy since her marriage into the British royal family. Her journey has been marked by public scrutiny, media frenzy, and her own quest for identity outside the royal spotlight. Rumors began circulating that Markle might make a surprise appearance on the red carpet, which sent shockwaves through the festival. Almodovar, known for his fierce advocacy for artistic integrity and authenticity, reportedly felt that Markle's presence could overshadow the film's moment. In a move that shocked many, he allegedly called security, urging them to be on alert and prevent Markle from stepping onto the red carpet. The decision sparked a fierce debate in the media and among fans. Was this an act of artistic protection or a celebrity feud brewing? The incident quickly became a hot topic in entertainment news. Headlines blared. Almodovar vs. Markle. A red carpet showdown. The clash of personalities. A celebrated filmmaker with a passion for storytelling versus a royal figure seeking her own narrative. Captured the imagination of the public. Social media exploded with opinions. Some supported Almodovar, praising his commitment to ensuring that the focus remained on the film and its artistic merit. Others criticized him, arguing that Markle's presence could have added a unique layer of intrigue to the event. The debate highlighted the contrasting worlds of film and royalty, and how each sphere interacts with the public. In the days following the festival, both Almodovar and Markle remained in the spotlight. Almodovar continued to receive accolades for the room next door, while Markle's presence, or lack thereof, was dissected in countless articles. This incident raises intriguing questions about the relationship between celebrity culture and artistic expression. Is it fair for an artist to want to protect their work from being overshadowed? 